Stone Brothers Production. Hello again. This is my second tutorial. Um, this is uh, Autodesk Maya. Uh, I am going to be creating a uh, crate. Just a simple uh, model. I'm still in the beginning phase of showing like people that, that are beginning learners. It's going to be real, real low poly. Alright, so we're going to go to the polygons tab and then click uh, the cube. And we're going to drag it out and lift it up. Always change the size on this. Make it a little bit more boxy. Down there. And then you're going to go to your modeling tab. Then you're going to click Mesh Tools multi-cut and then you're going to hold down the control button and click like that hold the control button again click like that hold it again click and one more time Boom. And go on here And one here. These are going to be sort of the planks where that it's like the outer edge of the box. I'll show a quick little example of this. So you're going to go to this is what it's going to look like. Those are going to be like the outer planks for it that that holds in like the main part. Okay, so now for the, the diagonal flank, uh, we're going to go here, click here, click here, and click here, click around, click here, something like that. There, and do. You could always move the vertices later if you mess up on something. And then enter. Got that. You don't want to have a, an end gone, which is more than five uh, edges. So that's four, three, and that's four. Oh, wait, no, I'm wrong. But I'm going to be closing that out, and out anyway, so you don't have to worry about that. So you go here, click there, click there, about there. There we go. We got a little side plank right there. Alright, so we're going to go to face mode, grab all the large faces like this, and then we're going to go to control E, which is extrude, or you can go to mesh, edit mesh extrude, and then you do that, and then you move, you move the blue slider in, and then it'll push it inwards, so that way you can see the the planks like that and then we're going to go back to mesh tools multi-cut because we have an end gun I see so we're going to go like that close it off oops and then that close it off and now we have ourselves a crate Really simple crate. And we're going to go, now we're going to try to do something new, which is called UV unwrapping. UV unwrapping is 
something that helps the texture artist if you're like the one coloring the object you're gonna be it if you lay out the UVs right it's like basically un it's almost like unwrapping a present in a way and you unwrap like a box and you like lay it out like sort of like a cardboard box for example it's like in a T pose so that way we can get a good uh, UVs for our texture artist so UV UV editor. Let's see. It's basically already created because it's a simple object. So we're going to go to UVs. Click on UVs just in case if it's distorted in any way. We're going to do this. Tools. Smooth UV tool. We're going to hold the shift button and move right. Hold the shift button, go up like that. And see, it stretches out the other faces like that. And we're going to go on the inside. Hold the shift key and move it. Click under, over, then unfold and go like that. Go like that. Move up and right. Same to this. Right. Same thing to this. Hold the shift key like that. Like that. Move this. Like that. Do the same to this. Sides like that, and then grab all the way down like that, and hold the shift key. Do it again, and have it like that, all the way down. Do the same to here. Hold the shift key. Basically, do a it's not perfect, but it'll do the job for the texture artist. If it's this is like a very quick example, I'll be more in depth when I do the next tutorial on it. On UV unwrapping. You just grab in random areas because it like sort of unfolds it and places it in the right area, but sometimes it doesn't and it like distorts it like this. See how it's like a weird angle and in your model. It's not like that. It's not like jagged. So that's one problem we're facing in certain areas. It's like in different positions. But that's what a checkerboard my picture is for, which I'll go more in depth for that when I do more of just a UV unwrapping tutorial. But I uh, hope you enjoyed this really, really quick video. I'll do a more complex model in the next video. Um, and I don't know exactly what exactly what uh, model I'm going to do, but if you have any suggestions for low poly like this, even a little bit harder, like a medium poly maybe, just let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys have a good day, and subscribe and like. Leave me a comment down below for uh, my suggestions for tutorial videos.